Hey, what's up, everybody? I, I know I'm in my robe and I towel my head, but a thought came to my mind while I was in the shower, so I want to share that. Um, did you know you should not always wash your hair in the shower? I mean, because I'm a hairdresser, that, that's what this is about, right? But, um, I mean, one reason I wouldn't wash my hair all the time is because I want to hold on to my lashes, but that's not it. <clears throat> the reason I'm coming on to tell you is, is because the water that you usually typically typically shower in is very warm or like close to hot and when you're washing and shampooing your hair that's cool for the shampooing portion but when you condition your hair you should be finishing that up with a cool water right to stop the conditioner from working but scientifically you should be using the cool water the cold water to close off those cuticles to close them down to lay them back down to, um, you know, seal the conditioner and stop it from working. It's a lot of ways that a, people would, a lot of people would say that. So that's what you typically should be doing, okay? A healthy head of hair um, looks like, well, and this is always good. Let's write on the mirror since it's all frosted, right? 80, 20. And what that is is 80% um, cortex and 20% cuticle, okay, on the outside. When those cuticle, cuticles are um, remaining up, they're getting heat processed throughout the day, so they're shedding off, but new cuticles grow in those places, okay? So scientifically, uh, those cuticles are coming back. You have an extra ones on there more than should be, and so the hair is uh, becoming hard, stiff, and dry, okay? So 80-20 um, doesn't just help me eat. It blesses my hair too. Y'all think about that. Drop a comment if that helped.